the evening as we take a peek behind closed doors in Tokyo. Japan. Quiet, reserved, polite. At least in public. Yes, if I were to mention Lycra and Shaggin to you, you'd immediately assume I was talking about the Strictly Come Dancing after show party. But over in Japan, that points to Zentai. You see, while some Brits might relax with a glass of Pinot, some Japanese people leave their inhibitions behind by donning full body suits and using their free and anonymity to crack on with anyone and everyone. To get under the skin of this story, we needed someone demure and discreet. We couldn't find anyone like that though, so we got Vicky Patterson instead. Japan is the centre of the Zentai movement, in particular Tokyo, where there are 3,000 of them and counting. I'm here to meet university student Yukenko, a member of the Tokyo Zentai group, to find out why she and many like her feel more comfortable wearing a second skin. Hi. Hi! How are you? I'm fine. I'm Vicky. I'm Yukinko. Oh, lovely to meet you, Yukinko. <laughs> God, well, you look absolutely fantastic. Oh, thank you. Can you see me in that? Just a little Just bit. Just a little yeah. bit. So, what's the crack? This is called, it's called Zentai. Yeah. Am I correct? Yeah. And what exactly is the concept? When you wear Zentai, yeah. your face is uh, covered. Uh -huh. So, you can be a different person, you can be anything. Yeah. Normally, I'm so shy and... <clears throat> I totally get it. So in your normal everyday clothes, you're slightly yeah. introverted, you're slightly shyer, but when you dress up like Zentai, it allows you to say the things and do the things and act yeah. how, deep down, you want to act. <laughs> yeah. And you all get together how often? About once a week. Oh, OK. Yeah. How do you go to the toilet? Um, like... Oh, you unzip? Oh, God, that is so much <laughs> ag, mate. I remember when I wore a jumpsuit on a bank holiday mm -hmm. Monday to go out on the lash once, and in and out of it every time, especially because <laughs> there was a massive queue. It just took us ages. It put me off jumpsuits for life. <laughs> when you're in Zentai, do you speak, or is it all you, do you express things through gesture, predominantly? Yeah. Oh, so how would you say, like, hello to someone with your gestures? You can go mimes looking around, then gives a little <laughs> wave. I love it, I love it, I love it. Wearing her floral Zentai suit, Yukinko slowly twirls her hands. I don't necessarily understand why she'd want to dress up as Zentai, but I do get the concept. It's people who can't necessarily express themselves in everyday life, whether they be shy, whether they be introverted, whether they just be bound by the confines of their culture. They dress up like this and are finally able to say and do and interact how they want to. Yukinko and the rest of the Zentai club regularly hang out together at their local park. And if I'm going to truly experience the Zentai culture, I'm going to have to slip into one of these suits. And they don't exactly leave much to the imagination. Oh, oh my God, you kind of get more than one wear out of these, like if it's a hot day. I'm telling you that, you won't get away with Febreze in it. God, why I? All right, here goes nothing. Oh, for God's sake! Oh, fuck off! I'm going to Zentai. This is the worst thing that's ever happened to us in real life. Can you guys see? Yes. How can you I see? <laughs> you picked a white one. Well, what's that mean? Um, white one reflects the sunshine so you can see. Oh, for God's <laughs> sake! <laughs> so basically what you're saying is, I've been totally done on my first day as a Zentai. <laughs> I'm claustrophobic. Can't say a thing. I don't like it at all. For God's sake. After the break, Vicky finds a more suitable.